Hi everyone and welcome back to Diamond Paintings with Mike. Yes, and today we have got a really exciting, you can tell in my voice I'm very excited because I found the white drills, yes! So we can get all of this cloud done and we're gonna be doing a bit of the E as well, hopefully. So the plan of the action for this session is we're gonna try and just patch this up a bit. Um, it might be a quick session, but I just wanna try and patch this up as best we can because I have been, it's been aggravating me where this bloody drill is. <laughs> so today I have spent the whole of the day sorting out all the drills, trying to find these drills. Um, I used to keep all my paintings, uh, all the drills separate to the paintings in a big box, but I discovered that that weren't working. So I now put the painting with the drills in my portfolio book thing. So uh, yeah, hopefully we, you know, and the idea is we can just go to the portfolio, whack the jewels out, job done. So, and there they were, right at the bottom of the box. So, uh, which is weird because when I kitted this up, I bring it all in here. And I done, you know, done it all in here. So, I don't know how I've ended up putting them back in the box, but somewhere along the lines they've uh, ended up back in the box. Um, I think it's because I had to need, had the, uh, that idiot that wanted to come around to do the worktop that must have packed them away but oh, it's so good to see this like you know it's gonna we're gonna get to see the clouds so this is really exciting just remember I ain't got my cover binder yes I have I'll tell you what we'll use the love heart for this one purely because I can't be asked to get up <laughs> okay let's just get this under here how do you like your eggs in the morning? I like mine with a yolk. <laughs> Already has a yolk. But yes, it's been a really cold, miserable day today. Um, perfect day for diamond painting. And um, yeah, so then tomorrow we've got Britain's Got Talent, oh yeah! I'm so excited because we get to do Britain's Got Talent. Now you can see I'm very colour coordinated here. I love to use my white pen with white drills. So as a rule, I like to change the pen each session. So yeah, it's, um, it's quite nice really. But I have got a pen coming from AliExpress and I ordered it on AliExpress and quite bizarrely they had free postage and I only had to pay like 46p but it is taking absolute ages it's been saying that it's been leaving the destination country um, for the past week so I don't know when it's gonna come um, I'm just gonna have a quick look actually see if it's changed but yeah, I don't know when it's going to come. It's absolutely ridiculous. Um, I'm not going to show you what it is, but I'll just uh, see where it is on the thing. Yeah, leaving destination country apparently. So, uh, let's have a little look. Oh, I can't be asked. It's playing. Oh, actually. Yeah, so it's saying that the estimate is. 4th of June. Now, I think they've sent it on the most slowest service because it's saying that apparently the 4th of June. So, we could be in for a long wait. So, yeah. But that's what it says. Leave in departure country, apparently. Um... It's been stuck there since the 14th, saying that it's not even updated or nothing. And it's now what the, um, 14th, I don't even know what we're on, but it's, it just keeps saying the same thing over and over again. It's been like that for a week. And each day you check, it just says leaving departure country. Well, it doesn't seem like it's on the train, uh, plane for me. It just don't, I'd love to go on a sleep train because um, some train journeys are so long. I'd love to go on one of them. That'd 
be absolutely fantastic. So yes, I would like to do that. But I'm just like over the moon with this. There's so much lovely colours in this. So to finally have found this, because I haven't had much time to find it because I've had, you know, busy with work and stuff and Easter bank holiday and all the palaver of getting back into filming and stuff. And oh, do you know what? I've not missed it one bit. <laughs> but um, I've missed I've missed diamond painting. Because I haven't painted it uh, for a while. But, um, yeah, I miss the old days when I used to, like, listen. I used to do off-camera projects and listen to music. But I then regretted not filming them. So, yeah. I'm not happy with this. Let's get that down a bit if we can. There we go. That's a bit better, isn't it? But, yeah. I've had Amazon delivery today of, um, they're called Swizzle Sweets and they're like a whole big bag, 18 and I got two free, can you believe it, absolutely brilliant, um, so yeah it's pretty good. Yeah right, so you see here that's the defect drill, this is what I'm saying, like never get these ones because they can get stuck up the shaft and then you have to get like a cocktail stick to get it out. What I do is if they get stuck I just use a little cocktail stick and then just sort of like go in there and poke it out but yeah. Um, so yeah. But the one thing that, oh I can't do that yet, I've got to save this chicken yet. I want to put that white drill in. So that's the eyeball. <laughs> it's nice that this painting has an eye because many paintings that I do, they won't drill the eye. So, yeah. But the most funniest thing happened, right? So in the dentist, the nurse is going, because obviously I was having two, <laughs> two teeth out, and she was going, right, nice deep breaths for me, you know, slowly breathing, and she's going, you're doing really well. Um, and then like five minutes later, she goes, right, you're doing really well, keep going, you know, you're doing really well. Because um, I will just let them crack on and do what they need to do, unless the pain starts hurting, then I'll flag it up and I'll go, right, stop you know, put your hand up and stuff. And um, she kept repeating it over and over. And I thought, am I, I, I actually thought like I was a woman pregnant when she kept going, you're doing really well. I felt <laughs> it was the most weirdest um, experience because I've never had a dentist do that before. So yeah, it was quite good. But currently I have this like spongy shit in my mouth. Um, it's like a some sort of gauze thing. It's a sponge with like this antiseptic stuff that sits in the socket, but yeah. But um, it's supposed to like keep the pain down, but it starts to hurt again. So I don't know whether the sponge needs changing. I don't even know if it falls out itself. But um, yeah, back to square one again, because the pain's kicking up again. So uh, I don't know what's causing it. You know, they say it's dry socket, but I've got an appointment on Tuesday, but I'll hopefully get this bloody thing gone. I just want the hole to seal up now and then. 
should be the end of this wretched pain. I don't know. So yes, it's. Uh, I feel like I need a nap because I've got. Um, I'm beginning to get a headache. This is the thing with sweets. Like you'll eat sweets and then like you suffer with a headache afterwards. I'm just fed up with like constant pain. So yeah, maybe a nap. I don't know. Yes, the weekends we've got Hannah's birthday and then obviously I've got some parcels that went there today. So that's good. So I'll pick them up and then I will show you guys once I'm back over here because I will probably stay till Tuesday over there because obviously it's her birthday and that and I want to give her a gift. But apparently she's going out with Jack all morning and afternoon so the only time I can see is in the evening so obviously she'll want to open my mum's and all that first and I don't know whether they're doing a party because normally when it's a birthday like they'll do like music and nibble bits in the um kitchen and sandwiches and that sort of thing so yeah I don't know the future's not ours to see Say hurrah, hurrah, that will be, will be. <laughs> oh no, not pointless again, please no. <laughs> I don't like that program, just bear with me. Flock it, there we go. Flock it sounds better. Um, it's not the programme, it's just, I just can't stand that Alexandra Armstrong. He thinks he's funny when he's not funny, if you get me. So I just don't like him. Um, Richard Osborne is, is okay, but it's, it's his voice as well. I don't like his voice, it's weird. So, um, Never really liked him. You know when there's something there, you don't really know what it is, but you just don't like the person. You don't know what it is you don't like. You just know there's something there that you don't like. <laughs> but yes, every time I see that pointless thing on, I'm, I'm like, quick, turn it off. I mean, the theme tune is boring as well. Most awful theme tune ever. And then obviously a bit later on in the month, the 24th, we've got, I'm slippery, get me out of here. But apparently Britain's got talents on every day. So uh, that's interesting. I think what happens is, is it's on every day, because obviously it's pre-recorded uh, auditions and stuff. And then that's pre-recorded. And then when it gets into the lives, they will start to vote people off and pick people. And then it goes to live and stuff like that. So I reckon it's probably here for a good six to eight weeks. Might be seven weeks actually, because uh, Saturday Night Takeaway was seven weeks, weren't it? So, I don't know, maybe. This is another popular colour as well. This white does pick up quite a lot, so it's a lovely, uh, it's another popular colour. Um, but you know what? I've been having a browse on Amazon, I've seen a hell of a lot of paintings I want. They're all three ninety nine. I can't believe it. So it's just amazing. <laughs> but yes. I keep thinking today's Saturday and it's not, is it? It's Friday. <laughs> I'm going mad. <laughs>
well look at that i just think i've the i've worked on a painting similar to this sort of sky pattern which was toy story um and that sort of went in the blue and white me method but yeah it's nice that we've got a little bit of power blue the colors just go so well i mean with paintings you never really know if it's going to come out right unless you put the drill on it first so for me i i love it i think it's great absolutely fantastic and i've got the f color as well so bizarrely that's actually a pink color um sorry it's 13 is yeah the f color here so it's all like this um bits of f here and it's splattered all down here it's only 5f and this dot on here with a bit of zero as well but um you know just to get this filled up is fantastic so we should be in a position where we should be block color blocking soon um but again it's i've got various different i need to free up some more trays um there's so much color in this but yeah so it's it's quite good I wonder if there's a way you could like build your own sort of or make your own sort of diamond painting, you know? That'd be quite fun. Okay, so we've got mainly all of that done up the top, which is brilliant. We'll just sort out these ones up here and then it will be a case of just doing a bit of the chicken's head and I think we'll end this session on probably we'll do a bit of this we won't do F yet because I need to get trade but we'll do all of there and that and then we'll just do a bit of that E and block that up a bit and uh, yeah I think we'll finish on that session and then hopefully the plan of action for the next session is I'll get a tray um, and just try and fill up this little bit here but yeah with me um, if I'm missing a colour I'd rather go on um, if it's due to be filmed that day then I'll try and get it ready for filming but if not I'll just work with what I've got and uh, do it the next time but yeah this is a lovely lovely painting I'm really tempted to buy another one I really like this I think for me it's just like it's just the colour for me. It's it's just a colourful, cheery one that puts a smile puts a smile on your face. Now see there, there's a really tiny little winny 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 one there. Um so that's a reject. We don't use them ones. Reminds me of the racket dolls. <laughs> Does anyone remember that? God blimey, years ago it used to be called the racket dolls. Racket dolls. Put them in the reject bin, the ragged dolls, or Annie and Teddy. Was it Annie and Teddy? No. Yeah. And it used to go, Bob Hoskins would go, oh, I hate sprats. But that would be the little bear, but yeah, such a brilliant, we've lost so many, you know, good programs like Art Attack and, cool, that went on for donkey's years. Rainbow, where it goes, do, 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 rainbow flying high. Everyone can see it shining over the sky. Paint the whole world with a rainbow. And you used to have um, Bungle the Bear, George the Hippo, but no one ever knew what Zippy was. That's the problem. What was? The big question is, what was Zippy? If anyone knows, put it in the comments because I'd love to know. I mean, he can't have been... He wasn't a giraffe, was he? So it's like, what was he? But there is a rude version of Rainbow, but I'm not going to go into that. Um, you can just Google that if you want to see it. Um, I think there's a video somewhere on YouTube, but I'm not going to go into that. Uh, <laughs> I don't really agree with it. So, but look at that. We're getting all of this, and it's nice that it's not just the you know the one colour. The chicken has got a bit of three different shades to it, or maybe four which is really lovely indeed. So it's it's really lovely. That will be, will be, love you to 
it's not ours to see. Say hara hara. Okay, so that's the white bit done. Now this is this, um, I'm just trying, yeah, the seven there, um, which is the B color. Oh no, hang on a minute, what's happened here? Seven, oh, right, seven. Ah, so I must have, seven's this color here. Okay, I don't know why I kicked that up. I wanted to do the E, but okay. E's not allocated yet, so in that case, I will do that another time. But yeah, nice quick easy session there, guys. I'm sorry it's a short one, but I really wanted to try and patch this up and get this colour block in first. Um, we've got a few more segments around there to do. Oh, the eye! We can't be forgetting the eye. No! Eye, eye, man. Popeye. <laughs> there we go. He's got his little eye. Oh, look at that. It looks better without the eye doesn't it? I mean, you could just drill that and then leave that showing. That is so good. If you've got a camera or anything, zoom in. You've got the eyeball there, you know. So I would be tempted to leave that there, but because it's going to bug me if I don't put it there, I'm going to keep it there. But anyway, that is that session done. It's looking absolutely beautiful um, so far. It could be that that's the eye, actually, because it's hard to say without the jewels there. But yeah, but that's looking so much better now that we've got that on, isn't it? Look at that. Fantastic. So I'm really happy with that. Um, the next session we will try and block it as much as we can because we're now in that block process again. We had some patches there, but um, we should be working on this layer here. And then as more trays come available, um, we can... What I might do is finish off the Captain America card that I still need to do and free up that tray. And then we can just... We are getting there slowly but surely, but I would like to be in a position where we can just block, block, block without patches everywhere. But anyway, most the time kitten that seven up. <laughs> but anyway, take care, guys. Have a lovely day. Please remember to like, share, subscribe, tap the bell. If you want to be notified for all the videos I do, and I'll catch you later. Bye, guys.